What is up YouTube, Ryan Maniac V2 here and I have another tutorial for Cinema 4D. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make multiple colored text, or uh, I'm going to be showing you how to use three colors in your text and also two colors on your text. So this is going to be quick tip number four. And uh, yeah, so let's get started from scratch here and delete everything. And uh, yeah, so go ahead and make your MoGraph uh, text, your 3D text. And once you have that loaded up, go into the text caps menu down here and hit fill it cap on start and also for end hit fill it cap. So now we're going to make the three materials. One, two, and three. And uh, go ahead and make your primary color. This is the color that's going to be covering most of the text. And I'll just gonna choose, I'm just going to choose i just going to choose red. And then make your second and third colors. I'll make white and a dark gray. So... This is a very important step right here. Drag your primary color on first. It has to go first. And then drag your second and third colors on in any order. But make sure your primary color goes first. So now for the secondary color, in my case it's white. Uh, click on the texture itself. Go down to tag. Uh, click on selection and type capital C1. And uh, right now we don't have any results yet because we still have to mess with the gray text. Or the gray texture. So click on the gray texture right here. Go to the tag menu and click on selection and type capital R1. And uh, now you see we have achieved our results. So um, what we're going to do now, I'm going to show you how to switch them around and whatnot. So um, if you want your white to be where the gray is, you just type R1 in the selection area. And then with the gray, you'll type C1. And it just kind of reverses the colors. And uh, as you see, it looks pretty cool. Um, there's no really good lighting in here, obviously, but this is just a basic tutorial. But anyways, if you want two colors only, delete one of your colors, and then choose a C1 and a, in your selection, and render it out. But that doesn't look too good. I want, the, I want this part to be gray as well, not just the front. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag that same material on again, and I'm going to uh, make sure that one says C1, and go to the duplicate of the material and type in R1 and uh, now it looks a bit more cool I guess but um anyways guys that has been a basic tutorial or quick tip number four for uh, Cinema 40 uh, showing you how to use multiple color text so subscribe and please comment saying what you see telling me what you would like to see in the future and I uh, hope you like this video please click the like button and uh, if it really was your favorite video favorite it but not asking you to so yeah thanks guys and check out my other videos they're really helpful so see you guys